I'll just ignore you and take my delicious purple. But there's a lot of slugs in that direction. Wait, where is... Batteries... So we want... Oh, shit. Let's go down before checking the map. Just a little bit. So what I want to do is go... Is it over here? Yeah, it's over here. That's where we need to go. And would it be wise to like go in that, just fly in that direction? Or wait, I have production in that area. So wait, I did take uh, slugs in that area. So you know what, let's go back into the hypertubes. I'll just do this. There we go. <sighs> so, you know, I probably should get rid of this stuff on the sidebar. If I can while I'm in the hyper tubes, I don't think I can though. So, what we're going to do is just go over to our aluminum production area for the batteries, and then any excess ingots will ship back to the factory. Oh, probably should check to see if I can build another drone port. If not, then I'll just leave it at that. Okay, I got that crash site over there. Don't have to worry about that. You know, I just realized I still haven't been up there. Do I even need to go up there? Well, anyway... Just keep this going. This is slow. This hyper tube is too damn slow because it's always going uphill. Now it's going a little bit faster. So let's just double check that. If I have the parts for the drone port, then we'll go. If not, well, I guess since I'm back at the factory, I can get the parts. But clear list and then drone port. Where are you? Yeah, I can build it. No problem. But really, we really need to deal with that aluminum production there. Aluminum casings, I should say. Once we get that back up and running, we'll sh we should be fine. Then I can work on the particle accelerators, get that nuclear pasta going. And then from there, then I can expand the steel pipes and the stators. Space elevator. Where's our space elevator? It's like right here. And then... Going through this area. Did I take all the slugs in this area? I took that one. Oh, I probably should check this area over here. Oh, there's a slug. Probably should take that since it's an easy slug. You know what, let's take it before I forget. I can just jump up here. I don't. Oh, hi. Uh, I'm just gonna go. You know what? Damn it. Let's just. <laughs> so never mind. Let's just do this. Let's just make things easy so we don't have to deal with it. Yeah, there we go. While I'm over here, oh, there is a slug over there. Let's go and get it. Yeah, 
And there's a lot of gas plants in this area. Let's get the slug before they release their gas. All right. It's hard to see anything. And I did get whatever was up there. I think that was a uh, purple slug. So we already got that. Now I kind of feel like clearing this area out. How many explosives do I have? I have 12. Just clear this out. I'm not even aiming at these gas plants. I'm aiming at the trees. Yeah, that's a little bit better. That was a weird throw. Probably because I was strafing. You know what? Let's just use all of our explosives. Okay, so anyway, where were we? Oh yeah, aluminum ingots. And probably should turn these into power shards right now, just so it's not taking up space in the inventory. There we go, and we have 30 power shards ready to go. Okay, so where's the ingots? We need to, like, tap into this somehow. And where are we going to put the drone port for that? We're probably, like, right here. Like, I don't think we need more water. So, let's just do this. Clear out these trees. Might as well take these berries while I still can. Oh, come on. The hitbox is kind of weird. I can't just grab it. I have to like aim a specific spot. But you know, this works. Okay, we'll replenish our berries here. There's actually a lot of berries just in this small area. I like that. Oh, there's another one here. Wait, what the hell? Go into my hand. There we go. So anyway, I'm thinking... Get rid of this area. And then just put foundations here. And then we can, oh, let's put, I guess we can put a foundation here. Or we need concrete. Let's put the foundation here, this here, and this here. Unfortunately, we have concrete being produced in this area, so I can just take more concrete from over here. Easy concrete.
I'll just put this ramp here. Perfect. So, we're gonna produce, or we're gonna build our drone port, maybe like right here. And yeah, this works. Now I need to feed batteries into this thing. I also need to reconfigure this. Wait, I didn't need to do that. Change this around. And then this way we put our splitter this way. There we go. So, how are we going to do this? You want know try to put merger can we connect this like directly to this thing connect it like so and then Wait, no, we can't do that. Okay, so we're gonna have to figure something else out. This here. Or wait. Let's do this. Let's do this. And then put a merger here. There. Simple enough. Then we just connect this over here. Aluminum ingots source. But we don't need to connect batteries here because the destination port already has batteries. So what we're going to do... Uh, where are we? Aluminum ingots destination. Okay, so you have... Okay, you're taking off. Yeah, you're okay, but... The other port... What is the... What's happening with the other port? What does this check mark mean? Okay, drone status is en route. So, I need to see this first because... This tooltip is like... No drone, no destination set. And, oh, here we go. Now it's moving. You are moving. So any excess aluminum ingots being produced here will go into our factory. So just a little bit of extra production 
of aluminum ingots going into our factory. Alright, so let's get out of here. And yeah, there's the drone. Let's get out of here. Oh, before we go, get these berries. Oh, come on, berries. Like, there is a lot of berries in this area. Come on. Yeah, lots of berries. So, before we go, need to bring some explosives with me. Let's go in here. Alright, so we have some additional production of aluminum ingots going into the factory. It's only th like three constructors worth. Or, not three constructors, uh, three foundries worth. But that's still pretty good. It's easy enough to do. Oh, I do need to go over here. We need to bring some black powder and some explosives. Obviously, the black powder is... You have got to be kidding me. Wait, what? I'm confused. So... Which circuit broke? Like, it's not going to tell me on the map. Oh, jeez. Oh, I still have another hard drive. Oh, I completely forgot about this. Okay, so anyway, we got instant plutonium cells. I don't want that. Electromagnetic connection rods. Hmm. Maybe not. Find concrete. We probably need concrete at this point. Oh, I don't know. Like, it doesn't seem like we need that many uh, control rods anymore. And this, I'm probably not going to get that. And find concrete. I don't know, maybe? I guess we'll go with that. And then we'll scan the next hard drive. So anyway. And then we will get some powder. Just one stack will do. And we should be good. Alright, let's get out of here. Hmm. Okay, so never mind. I was thinking maybe we can swap around some more of this production, but I'm thinking... Or actually, we can take back the power shards because we now have encased industrial beam production over there. We can take this back. Take back our power shards. We don't need that much anymore. And then we can like move it to the factory. So maybe in a few hours we'll see like how it affects our production elsewhere. But for the time being I just want those power shards back just so we can repurpose them elsewhere. And do need to get rid of all of that biomass. I'm also gonna need to start uh, get that nuclear pasta going, and that means making the ninth floor of the factory. I'm gonna have to bring up the copper powder. You know, probably should check that out first. See how much we have stored now. Oh, damn you. Let's go over here. Let's check this out. B 
These are batteries. So we're storing all of this stuff in here. So we have two industrial containers full of this stuff. Nice. Okay, so... And you know what? I just had an idea. How about... Let's put another container. Going crazy with the containers here. It's crazy. Oh, I guess I can't do that. Alright, you win game. It's just gonna be those two containers. Probably have too much anyway, so might as well just keep it like that. Okay, so... Okay, we now have plenty of aluminum now. Forty-five, fifty-seven. You know, for the time being, let's just... Maybe I should just overclock these constructors. Yes, I said it. We're overclocking constructors. Or, actually, we can't. Still not getting enough aluminum. Oh, this is actually expensive when it comes to aluminum. Wait a minute. You know, this is kind of weird. Let me check this real quick. Oh, it's because it's splitting. Okay, so never mind. I thought I didn't upgrade something. Well, Belts over there aren't upgraded, but I don't need to upgrade them. But anyway, here's lots and lots of ingots coming in. Lots of it. You know what? I still have ingots in here. Do I have room? You know what? No. So, let's dump the biomass and then... What I'm going to do is work on the ninth floor. Oh, these are all gone now. And flower petals we can just put in here. And the reason we're now... We now don't have like enough of the power, I guess. It's because of all of these biomass reactors. So we're gonna do something about that. I'm just gonna take this. Like, let's just keep this going. Like I have plenty of biomass, I'm not really using it. This will, at the very least, delay the requirement for me to turn on nuclear power. But, you know, I guess I have to do that eventually. Let's do this. Like, we still have two industrial containers full of biomass, so... We can just burn it. Now, there is a way to, like, automate the whole process of loading all of this biofuel into... turn it into power. But the thing is, it requires me to turn the biofuel into liquid biofuel and then put it in a fuel generator. And I really don't feel like doing that. So, it's just gonna be this.
Now, a fuse did broke. Or a fuse did break, but I have no idea where that is. Like, everything is running perfectly fine. So, I have no idea where the fuse broke or where I ran out of power. Okay, so anyway, we have all of that now. Let's continue building stuff. Put all of my sheets in here. Oh, probably should get some concrete. And what's this thing doing here? Oh, I forgot to clear this. Let's get that back. How are these screws doing? I probably should check the rotor production, see how that's doing. Yeah, rotor production is all backed up, so... Obviously... This did a good job. Well... Rotor's over here. Like, do I need to overclock this anymore? You know what? Look... Yeah, let's take these off. I only overclocked one. The hell? Oh, alright. Well, since this is all backed up, I can... Just leave it at 100%. Alright, so let's go get some concrete. And then we will build the ninth floor of the factory. I can get rid of this. Get another stack of concrete. You know, probably should check the space elevator. Let's go check this out. Okay, so we have 1,400 of this, 192 of that, zero of that, and we got our mem. All right, so we got electrode circuit boards. That requires petroleum coke. We got this again. Coated cable. Like, we already have one way of making cables, one other way. Uh, definitely not doing this. Okay, fine, let's do this. 